from Jonathan now. What's the purpose of your camp? Uh, the purpose of my camp is uh, me bringing back the European experience I've taken throughout the years to the Canadian soccer. I think um, you know, with my experience there, I can help uh, the kids learn a bit more of what to expect uh, across the pond. I think the, the soccer in Europe is a bit higher level than in Canada. And um, with the sessions I've learned, I'm trying to bring back here and you know teaching the kids what the basics are and I think uh, the fundamentals are very important in, in this game and I think um, the kids enjoy it as well and make it fun um, I like doing it this is my second year doing the Seoul soccer camp and I hope to continue doing it with these kids and uh, the turns are great I get good feedback from the kids and especially from the parents as well so do you need, do you and, uh, yeah. you need improvement on or you say it's going fine so far it's going fine so far but of course we you live and you learn you wherever every uh, experience you take in as a coach and as, as players you um, you learn from it and um, certain things we could do a bit different uh, I think a couple of things we did different from last year we did this year we, we made it a bit better especially for the, the soccer tournament for example um, I think the kids really enjoyed it. They, they put a lot of uh, passion into it. And, uh, you know, you, there's uh, only one winner in the game, and, mm. and uh, I think uh, everyone wanted to be that winner. Is that part of the uh, game or yes, the, um, the hero? No, that, 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 part of your no that was um, um, part of the camp, yes. I think uh, bringing back uh, a lot of professionals in, in one area because of our busy schedule, I think it was important that we, we did that together and play to, to, to raise money because. Um, then again, family and, and friends, and that's how you that's how you did it. We just called each other up and said, "Let's try and play soccer together. Let's play pick up soccer." And we just made it into a what a, some uh, a special event, and uh, it was a good turnout. We raised uh, more than two thousand dollars, so um, we're happy with that. It was the first day, and our first time we did it, and I think we could do it again. So uh, no questions. When are you going to do it again? Hopefully, or? hopefully, uh, if, if everyone is up for it to do it again, I'm, I'm more than willing to do it again because I. I uh, is the, uh, what is your function job description in this camp? Yeah, so I'm basically uh, one of the guys here at the camp, um, running the camp from an uh, administrative standpoint, uh, reaching out to the players and the parents to uh, connect with them about the camp. Letting them know the philosophies of what Jonathan is trying to do with Seoul Soccer. Um, very much uh, connecting with the community uh, in Scarborough and in the Toronto area, talking to different coaches just to let them know about what it is we're trying to do with Seoul Soccer, um, with the fundamentals of, of developing kids, and uh, making sure that they understand that this is just uh, a camp, a three day camp. Um, and, and, and with that being said, you know, um, including a lot of a lot of former professional players who have come in to support us, you know, the likes of Dwayne Uzario, Jonathan Osorio, Jordan Hamilton, uh, AJ Gray, uh, tying in the whole fundraiser with that as well. So letting the, the, the soccer community know in Canada that we, we want to do this together. You know, our, our goal is obviously to to reach the World Cup.
day in the office, you know, just doing my thing. It's all I do, do my thing. Every day in the office. So the day, see where you can see the left, right, right foot here, right, right foot. Right foot. I should learn from this guy over here. This guy. Hey, 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 hero, hero. MGP 10, that's fantastic. Good job. I learned from, I learned from this guy right here. He taught me everything, but I think you're kind of looking a little bit, you know what I'm saying? That's what it was about, right there. This guy right here. Cool, right here. Cool. Okay. Under 10 final. We're following his father's footsteps. We're inside from final, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. One minute left. One minute left. One minute left. Yes, well done, Bill. Well done, Tiago. Yes. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Now, yes, move again, move again, move again. Yes. Now, where's the where's the elbow? Where's elbow? Where's that? Yes, good try, good try. <laughs> I tried. I'm not sure. <laughs> making sure everything is uh, running properly and, and smoothly. Uh, I just want to make overseeing things and helping out my son so that uh, you know, when he retires, he can continue this if he wants to. And, and I'm giving him some of the things that um, I'm, I'm, my experience, basically. Mm -hmm. So how you think it's going so far? It's going so year. far. I mean, I mean, how many, most coaches are, I mean, how many have played at this level? I mean, he's, he's got a bronze medal in the World Cup. He plays, he plays professionally in Syria. I mean, that's a lot of experience uh, and, and that he can pass on to all these kids and they gain a lot from that, you know? And um, did he really on the talent? Um, is he seeing talent here? Oh yeah, there is always talent. I mean, we, we, we just have to, we have, we just have to bring them out, them out because all the kids have talent and, and, and especially Canadian kids, they have talent. But the thing is we need coaches and training that to get them to that level and, 
we're still in an infant stages in terms of football and in Europe there's a lot of a lot of coaches that can do that and we need those coaches and, 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 and players like Jonathan who will be coaching in his time so yeah. you know but you seem into um, is this good on your new I know I, I always do because you know you always have to I, I, I try I try to do the little things so that they can focus on coaching so therefore they have everything ready so yeah. I'm just overseeing things that's okay all. all right thanks all right my um, pleasure what about yeah. the potential right. the, 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 the kids in your kids have uh, a lot of talent I've seen uh, the past three days um, from from ages from 9 to 18 kids are kids are growing every time I see them and it's important that we just you know try to Try to bring that into their system to be training a lot and to be working on their skills because practice does make perfect. Okay, thank you. So, thank you. Uh, so if anybody locally who want to get in contact with you, www.soulsoccer.com is uh, the website for Soul Soccer. I'm at Toronto Skills, www.torontoskills with a z.com, uh, and you can find me there. Okay, all right, yeah. thank you.